Again, great exercise here to open up shoulders, get a good stretch of the whole body. So as the arms all the way up, extend the body. Yeah, ex exactly. Extend the arms out. Yeah. Yeah, and if you want, hey, Carl, you want to go off? Go. Go, baby, go. Yeah. Hey, get airborne. Show them what you do. There you go. So airborne is great for the body, great for the landing. So every time you guys fly up in the air and then come back down, you're completely getting an entire workout on your entire core. Okay? Stop resting, lady. There you go, James. Nice. So James wants to fly. I can feel it. There you go. There you go. <laughs> hey, we all want to fly. We all want to feel free. There you go, Sam. There you go. Oh, she doesn't even need help. There she goes. Right, so let me keep you guys now all down. I'm going to keep you guys down on your knees. No, I'm going to move you off the knees now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, no, no. No, no more jumping. No, no, I know. There we go. All right, so now we warmed up. Let's go into something really easy. A high knee jog. Right, so you're going, to start, you're going to start running. Yep, get your knees up. Yep, get the arms going. So the arms moving is what's going to make it a lot easier for you. There we go. We found her now. Let's go, Jane. You got to catch her. You got to catch her. Are you guys, are you guys married? Or? Yeah. Okay, okay. So you definitely got to catch her. Hurry up. Hey, man, welcome to Shake. So again, 1030 in the morning. It's still beautiful. We're shaded here. So even though we're outdoors, even though we're in Miami, even though you guys think it's hot, it really isn't. We're covered. We're shaded. We're, it's a great feel. Great little breeze. We've got some fans on. All right? There she goes. Go, go, go. Let's go, Nick. There you go. We're in South Pacific. Or are you going to travel all around? Manawatu. Where, where? Manawatu. Near Fiji. Oh, Fiji. Interesting. And you're going there just again for the experience and stuff or, or work? It's all for work. Work. What do you do? Just, I'm just so curious. Very cool. Very cool. I'm always lucky. I get to meet people from all over the world. So, welcome to Shake. So, there we go. Keep going. Keep going. So, remember, you guys stop when you feel like it. I'm not stopping you guys. My goal, my goal is to get you guys continuously get your heartbeat up, continuously get you guys moving. Okay? There she goes. Get a little water when you need it. That's it. There you go. Definitely a runner. You're a runner? No? Oh, okay. Oh, you look it. You look it, though. So, you guys are not, now what I'm going to do, we're going to go really fast, right? So we're going to go, and we're going to do this again. You guys are going to go into your high knees, and when I say chop, I want to keep your feet really tight to the trampoline. Go fast, fast, fast. We're going to go maybe about three to five seconds, and when I say stop, my stop is to go back into high knees, okay? So you're starting at high knees, chop, back to high knees. We'll do this once or twice, just to get you guys really pumping your heart, okay? So let's go, 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 go. Yep, start it, start it, start it. Ready, set, chop, chop, chop. Go, 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 go. Five, four, come on, come on, come on. Three, two, one. All right, back to high knees, back to high knees. Right, so being, that, I need to hit that anaerobic, right? This is when you want to look at your watch and see how high your BPM goes. It's high? What is it? Just out of curiosity. 144. Right? 144, I need you 160. No good, no good. You're going too slow, James. You're too slow. Mine's 122. 122? Are right, you ready? Let's go, 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 go. Chop, 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 chop. Five. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Five, four, four, three. Come on, come on, James. Come on. Two, one. All right, nice, nice. All right, let's change it. Let's get you guys down into a simple squat, okay? So the difference here, I know you guys are used to a nice slow kind of squat. Here again, it's drop and pop. So it's going to be down, up and down, just up and down movement. There it is. Give me a wider base. Yeah, there you go. And now, now do the same thing. Drop, pop up. Yep. And then find that rhythm, right? There's a rhythm to the mat. You feel the rhythm? No, no, you got it. You're, you're on it. Yeah, Carl's got it. See, yep, there. 
and then bounce back up. Yep, bounce back up. So again, simple squat, a great, great exercise for everybody. Here's where you can get a lot of reps going, right? And the more rhythm, open up your base a little bit, Nick, so you just feel more balanced. There we go. Great for tennis. So if you guys are tennis players, this is a great way to work on your foundational movement. So if you want to get into your ready, this is a great time to get into ready and to work on your position and movement. Again, beautiful day here in Miami. Sunny, breezy. Okay, humidity is actually pretty controlled. Good, good save on the balance. I like that. There we go. When you get to 200, stop. <laughs> I'm joking, I'm joking. The guy scared, I scared him there for a second. So, what's fun though here, right, so that, that gets a little bit boring, right? So we're going to do a couple of, we're going to add some variations to it. So variation number one is I'm going to put you back into the squat. You're going to stay down here and you're going to want to start pulsating, okay? And what, the, what that means is, and it's hard to show, but the knees are coming up. So the upper body stays sort of static. And as you start bouncing, the knees are going to start bouncing. Let me see. So show me what you're doing. Yeah. And start. Yeah, yeah. There it is. That's it. That burn right there. And when it burns, hey, hey, that's purely mental. So the more you can exhale through this burn, you will become much stronger, okay, endurance-wise. Yeah, you got it. Right. That's it. Pop it, pop it. Nice, nice, nice. There we go. Let's go, Sam. Come on, dear. Come on, come on. Nah, I'm messing with you. Right, so feel like you're riding a wave. This is a great way to feel like you're riding a servo. Great burn. Right, and look, the minute you stop, the burn is gone, yeah. right? Right, so the reason that's because it's more electrical than it is muscular. Okay. So the minute, that's why when the minute you go back to do it, that's why I told you it's mental, okay? So you guys feel ready again? There we go. Yeah, let's go, let's go, let's go. Give me one more, give me one more. Yeah, but try to find more wavy in it. Like, try to get like a bigger movement in it, yes. Let's go, Luna. Let's go, Luna. There we go. That's the kind of movement you guys want. This is a great pulsation for the legs. Great burn. And Mama, where's Mama? What's Mama doing? What's Mama doing? There you go, Nick. Nice. Really hard. It's not an easy exercise. No, I know, I know. But it's fun. It's fun? Yeah. Good. That's all I need to hear. He's praying over here. God save me. God save the queen. All right, so we're going to stay in the squat, though. I'm going to add you now. I'm going to play with another variation. So now you're going to get back into that low squat. The difference is now you're going to be in the squat, and as you bounce from where you are open, you're going to open up a little bit more and just bounce in and out. So you're just going to do a small bounce in and out on one leg, and then when you get tired, you're going to go to the other leg and do the same kind of little bounce, okay? So open up nice and wide. Yep, and just take that first initial step. Yep, you can do that. You want to do that? You're welcome to do that. <laughs> but you got to do this though, James. Hold on. You got to put your hands here then. <laughs> and make that face, right? Hey, you guys have to have fun to enjoy yourselves. Without fun, there's no point in doing what you're doing. So the more fun we have, the more enjoyment in the exercises, the better. Sorry, I think my music. Hold on. So I didn't realize it stopped. There we go, yep. Wait, hold on, is it on? So, now let me change you guys one more time. So instead of squatting now, let me put you in a running pose. So you're gonna just put one foot in front of the other, bend your knees a little bit, your arms are 90, and I just want you to run in place, right? Really easy, yep. And this is again, it requires a lot of balance, as you can see, okay? So just, just like riding a bicycle, the faster you go, right? The better you'll stay. The slower on a bicycle, you know the concept, right? Now, you're leaning too forward, Jane. That's why you have a lot of weight. You have to redistribute your weight a little bit back to the back leg, okay? And be more vertical in your movement. That's okay. You're... So again, we don't need to complicate exercises here to make people to have fun. They just got to learn how to do what they already know how to do, right? Jump, squat, run. So these simple exercises are a great way to Learn how to learn how to resequence the body, how to get it moving properly, okay? Or add a little dance and boogie to it. Now, then, hey, if you burn out, switch legs. 
Yep, go ahead and switch legs. And if you've done both legs now, now I want you to start jumping and switching. So now jump and switch, go. Switch, quicker, and move the arms too, right? That's it, now you're really running. Right. And speed is all about how low you can stay. So the higher you go, Nick, the more fun you have. If you stay tighter to the trampoline and switch your feet quicker, right, that'll be more speed. So that's up to you where you want to go. Right, so James, go, 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 go. Switch it, baby, switch it, switch it. Go, get those dancing feet moving. There we go, move the arms, move the arms too, though. Right, that's the key, that's the key. Look up, Sam, look up. If you look down, you're going to be afraid of falling. You get it? If you look up, you know where you're going. You know the future. Forward. It's forward march, exactly. So again, I don't care age, shape, size, doesn't really matter. If you guys can enjoy jumping on a trampoline, you'll understand the beauty and the benefit of what we're doing here. Okay? Where is it? Where is it? 172. Nice. Wait, wait, wait. wait. Let me see that. Can, is it still there? 172? Yeah. Perfect. Nice, nice. Hey, man, here we are in the middle of the workout, 10 minutes into it or so, and I've got this guy's heart at 172. I got them prancing, jumping, bouncing. I got everything they need. All right, so let's now change it again. I'm going to change it now and make a little bit more strength in the exercise. So all I'm going to want you guys to do is a lunge. Okay, so we're going to do a lunge. And because of the trampoline, be confident that you can drop to your knee, right? So you're literally just going to drop to your knee, bounce back up, drop down to your knee, bounce back up. If there's any injuries, tell me, and then obviously I can, I can you know, modify the movement. But I want you all, all the way down. Yep. And don't be afraid to hit it. So okay. this is where you, it's going to take you one or two times, right, to be confident with the move, right? And then drop. And then well, listen, Nick, the arms come down, the arms come up to lift you. Down, lift down lift right so the arms come down James and come all the way down hit hit the track like drop drop all your weight let the weight drop you're gonna enjoy a lot more oh, yeah. yeah so don't be afraid of hurting yourself here because you won't right so come down Sam drop drop yeah more yeah drop more right yeah because look, watch if when you hit it it's gonna bounce you back up you see what I'm trying to do yeah, yeah so go back up go back up drop boom there you go there you go Hey man, we, got, we can do things here on the mat you guys can't do on, on the ground. You cannot do in the gym. You can use pads, you can use whatever you want, but it doesn't give you this kind of bouncing movement. This is what I'm looking for. This guy's flying already. He's going back to England on his own. There you go. That's it, that's it, Aluna, nice. And again, switch legs whenever you guys feel like it, but that's a great burn, great movement, great for the, great for the hips. So it's a lot better than normal lunging because you get a deeper you go deeper than you normally would in a lunge. There she goes. That's it. Hey, don't worry about that. Hey, I want you guys to lose balance. The more you guys can lose balance, the better. There we go. Perfect arm movement. Nice. Seeing an opening. Yeah, always touching the mat, Nick. Right? So bounce the toe on the mat. There she goes. Man, Luna, you got it all back, dear. Nice and strong again. There we go. So again, great exercises here. There we go, James. Oh, we found we found your we found your juice. Look at this dude. So again, great for the shoulders, great for the arms. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Excellent. Yeah, get the bounce going, get the rhythm going, get the movement going. 179? Nice. Is it still there? Yeah, oh no, 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 it's down to 173. All right, all right. You're going to have to work hard again. <laughs> But you do understand how great that is for your heart, right? And do you feel it, but how do you feel no pain on the body? And, and that's the key. That's the key. So, so now let me, let me keep you guys, let me keep you guys on your knees, okay? 
and then we're going to do a simple balance. So opposite arm, opposite leg up in the air. No, no, no. Like get on all fours and then pick up one arm, pick up one leg. And then, and then just look, Nick, do it for me. Yeah. And then all I want is your, well, give me your hand no, and stay there, right? And then I want the hand and the fit to go up together a little bit, right? There she goes. Perfect rhythm. You see our rhythm? Yeah, that's hand. And then bring it up. Yeah, quicker, right? Yeah, there it goes. Go up, up, up. There you go. Remember, I want you to be out of balance, right? Okay. So, so I'm forcing you that because yeah. that's what's going to engage you. James, excellent, brother. Strong man. Hey, this is for again. I always say this to everybody. This is for everybody and anybody. Doesn't matter, beginners, experts. You come here, you get it. We'll modify. We'll work you out. And we'll get now. Again, switch. When you tire out, obviously go to the other side. Other, other side. But your knee's okay on this one, right? Yeah. Okay. Right. Perfect, Carl. Now, if you're able, yeah. So you're tight here. I can see. Wait. Very. Yeah. So yeah. there. So right. Yeah, see that? You've got that, not me. Right. What's that? I, I can't hold You that. can't do that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, but that's when you want to yeah, start yeah, figuring yeah, out that. Yeah, yeah. So you got, you can see you got a certain ab abilities, but if you had more flexibility. Pretty easy to doing things wrong. <laughs> that's good. I've been doing it for 50 years wrong. At least he knows he's, what he's been doing. Right, so you got you switching to both sides? Yep. Perfect. All right. So I'm going to give you another hip exercise. Actually, you know what? Let's go. At Nick's, Nick's obviously talking about child pose. Let's get into a nice child pose. No, no. So the only difference is, hey, my child pose is open up your feet a little bit wider so your butt sits more back. Okay? Yep. And then I want the arms nice and long. Do not rest on the elbows. Take the weight off the elbows. Right. So keep your arms up. There you go. Perfect, James. And find that bounce. Right. So same here, Nick. So you see this little bounce? Yeah, so use your caboose to create a bounce and that'll stretch you out now. You feel the stretch? Yeah. yeah. So this is a really good stretch for shoulder joints. Okay? Perfect. And then every time, I'm going to touch you, Stan, every time you can reach further, right, as your butt stays where it is, you feel that stretch? Yeah. yeah. And get a great, great stretch. And then if you guys want, you guys can put your arms to the left or the right, like if you want to Yep, exactly. So now you're going to get a little bit more into your obliques and into your side a little bit. So again, hey, after a, lot of, a bunch of cardio exercises, you want to allow them to relax, meditate a little bit, and get a good stretch. Now they've loosened up. Best way to stretch, there she goes. Yeah, just get, take the weight off the elbows. Nick, yeah, try to get off the elbows. So I'll tell you why, it puts more pressure on the shoulders. Yeah. And if it hurts, don't do it, obviously. <laughs> but I'm just saying, if you want to get a better stretch or a deeper stretch, that's really the way to do it. So again, always great exercises here at Shake. Always want to help out. So after we're done with this, let's go ahead and sit on our butts, okay? And we're gonna work now a little bit on triceps and stuff. So we're gonna have our legs straight out. Luna, why don't you just put her with you and let her play with you, no? Oh, okay. Got it, got it. So I want, the, so I want your hands facing you, right? The fingers are gonna face you. And all I want you to do is literally pick up your butt a little bit and then drop it up and down, right? So this is tricep shoulders as you can. No, no, stay down. No, legs down. Yeah, and go up and down. And right back down. Yeah, there you go. Um, hey, everything's a bounce for me. So this should be burning over here. You feel it? Yeah. And if not, you're not doing it enough. No. And if you got the straight, right. Now, if you do have ab strength, you want to start lifting up your body, then that's the next sort of job. If not, you can stay where you are. Yeah, Carl's looking for the bounce. So again, you guys can do it nice and easy, or you can do a little extra bounce, add a little bit more ab exercise into it. So as you guys can see here, she's lifting up her legs and she's becoming more airborne. She's really getting into her abs and stuff. So again, great exercise. There we go. Good burn, good burn. Oh, 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 she's feeling it. I love it, Sam. There she goes. Nice, nice. Yeah. So rest a second, and we're going to do this one again. The only difference I'm going to have is you're, let, you're going to open and start bouncing and opening your legs and closing your legs. Now, the goal is to go as far as you can, but it won't be on the first bounce, right? So this will be great for flexibility here. So just start bouncing open, close, open, close, and then every time you can open up wider, open up wider, right? That's it. And then, and really, James, drop your butt in and try to float it. Yeah, that's going to allow you more. So again, they want a nice high-intensity workout. So here's a, 
a Vitality Victorious workout where at all times I got their heart at an elevated pace, always moving, always not opening up the body. Great here and opening up hips, opening up legs. Former gymnast over here, I can tell. Let's go, James. You ruined my video. Come on, man. You didn't pay me not to work. <laughs> All right, so let's relax you guys a little bit. I'm going to have you guys lay back on your elbows, right? So just sit back on your elbows, okay? And we're going to do now some ab work. And all I want you guys, first thing is to start tapping your heels in the trampoline. No, no, straight down, tap your heels in the trampoline, just like that, yep. Nice tight legs. This is, now, this is great to keep your tonality in the legs, okay, if you can feel that, okay, yep, perfect. And again, you can go high if you want, so if you want, like, you know, more power, you can go high up and down more, okay. If you want to hit obliques, you can just start walking your feet to the left and to the right, yep, there you go, you feel that already, yep. So if you want to get more into the oblique section, perfect, there. And again, if it's, and if you want, go high. And I go back to center and go high, high, high. And if that's, oh, damn, hold on, I need this side profile, look at this. Yeah, right? All right, well, you're not impressing me. Now get the legs over your head. No, I'm joking, I'm joking. Not today, exactly. So again, great. Right, see if you can go up higher, James. Yep, higher, 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 higher. Yep, nice straight legs. Good. Really good. And then if you want, so wait, for you, Sam, all of you, try to do both your feet at the same time. So put them together, yeah, lay back, and then lift them up just a little bit, right? Now go up, yep, and then drop. And drop. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Dropping is the key here. And drop them. Harder, James. Boom. Together, right? Find that unison. Nice. Yeah, your heart will be, exhale, exhale. This is where you gotta do a lot of exhalation. Exhale, exhale. It hurts? <laughs> Mama! Yeah, t tight knees, keep the knees tighter, Carl, right? Yeah, there you go. What's that? Oh. No, no, do it, I love that exercise. Listen, I will never stop somebody from feeling what they feel. Right, only difference is put your toes in the mat, put your toes in the mat. Yep, and then find that bounce. Yeah, no, keep them here. Yep, keep them. Okay, and now bounce with your back, like with your with your back, right? So, yeah, there you go. Yeah, there you go. Right, right. You feel that stretch, right? Yeah. How's that? Yeah. So now we're at the end, okay? So here comes the hardest exercise. I need you to lay down. <laughs> That's it. No, no. So I do want you to lay down. I want you to open up your arms and legs, okay? And, and Nick, just slide a little bit more to center, just so you'll feel better bounce. And I want you guys to use your butt, okay, as your bouncer. So as you push with your butt, yeah, there you go. And then we'll, we'll slow it down, slow it down a little bit. Keep doing it. And then I'm going to grab you. I want you to feel something, Jay. So you feel that stretch? Yeah. Wait, wait, put your head down. Your head is super important to stay down. So your head, your hands, and your heels are locked into the mat. You got it, Nick. And as you pop your butt up, you feel the posture you're doing? Yeah. So this is great for lower back. This is great for opening up your back and everything. Hey, Blanca. Hi. There you go. Hey, open up your feet a little bit, Carl. Like open up a little bit wider. Yeah. Yep, yep, you got it. Right. And then just feel. Oh, wait, hold on. Yeah. Feel that rhythm? Oh, yeah. Yeah, there it is. Yeah. So just imagine, the only thing I can tell you is imagine your ball, your ball, your butt's so like a basketball yeah. and dribble it. So you oh, push okay. down, push down with the butt instead of lifting. Okay. Don't be, yeah, don't focus on lifting and your hands are pressed in. So the more your hands are pressed okay. in, see now watch, you see how, you see how much stronger you become? Okay. Yeah. And if you pull yourself, so look at, find the cables in your body is what I tell them. So your li ligaments and tendons are really your cables. So the more I can stretch your cables, the better. Yeah. And then again, you got nice long legs, Sam, so you want to see how wide you can go. Yeah, if you have that ability, and now do the same thing, right? Yeah. 
Sorry? So great. Yeah, yeah, great on the hip. So, and you can also twist out. So if you want to, you don't need to, yeah. but if you want to feel, that's a great stretch too, depending on what you need. So again, after a nice 30 minutes of jumping and you want to sit back, relax, you want to stretch out the body as much as you can, okay, and take in all that you've done. So they put a lot of hard work here. They really got loosened up. And now the best part is to just stretch it all out. And now my last, last exercise. Lay down and do not move at all. Close your eyes and just take it in and feel that, and I say the energy, but feel what you just did, the energy pulsating through you. Like I say every time, welcome to Shake. My name is Isaac. If you haven't tried this kind of workout, come try it out here at Shake Backyard. If you guys are watching this on YouTube and you have a trampoline at home, follow these exercises. It's probably one of the best pieces of equipment that you guys can have. Get a great full body workout from stretching, strength, cardio, you name it, we can do it on this mat. So again, follow me, like my videos, share them with people. If you don't have a trampoline, share with people that do have a trampoline. You'll, they'll really appreciate that you thought about them and you really wanted them to be healthy and make them feel better. All right? I, I killed James over here. Dead. He's done. Peace, everyone. Are you still alive? <laughs> Let's see your watch, though. Wait, did you put, stop the thing. Let's see where you are. Let's see your results. 401 active calories. What's that? 401 active calories. Wow. That's a workout. No, I like that language. Sorry. <laughs> uh, what is your uh, BPM? What was your, like, BPM and stuff? Um, average was 100. Oh, I need to see that, please. Yeah, show me the calories and both. Wait, hold on. Calories, 402 active. 402. Nice. Total, 152 average, and then just about see it, 120. Yeah, of course, of course. And what did you think of the class? It was a lot harder than I thought it was going to be. <laughs> good. It's a good workout. All right. So again, man, welcome to Shake. My name is Isaac. Trying to change the game, trying to change the world. Peace.